only been about five days and there's so much grass growing out here. This, that is perfect right there. Where the heck did Dylan go, you guys? I got to turn off! All right, you guys, welcome back to Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch. Today, you guys, we are gonna be adding some giant apple trees. Well, they're not that big, but they're gonna be big one day, and they're gonna be going inside of this massive pond that we built here inside of the Amazon area. And as you guys see, we put the, all that seed inside of this area, and it is growing beautiful. Like, look at this. We got grass growing. It's only been about five days, and there's so much grass growing out here. We're gonna have to add a lot more seed, so that's real, real thick, and some other plants, but this is just to start. Like I was saying, we had to grab those plants. The water table, the water has risen up a lot, a lot, a lot, and that is awesome. Make sure you guys put those post notifications on and subscribe to my channel. And today, we have a special guest. My special guest is a good buddy of mine since elementary school. You guys probably seen him before in a video way back then, like in 10,000 subscribers. And he has an Instagram. And this Instagram, he cooks on this Instagram. It is insane and it's awesome and it's freaking crazy. He's right over here. You can come over here, Dylan. His name is Dylan. And you want to tell him your Instagram? What is your Instagram called? Diesel D Delights. Diesel D Delights. And there, it is hilarious. It is insane. He's a clown, but you never know. It is awesome, and he does some funny things. It's on his own time. When he's in college, he's over there, and he just messes around on Instagram. So follow him on Instagram on that channel. But also on top of that, he likes to get dirty, and I like to get dirty, but not as much because right over there, as you guys see, I have those nice duck waders. I wear those duck waders, and I'm going to go inside of the water. He's not going to have them. He's just going to get down in there and dirty, but that's what we're going to do right now. Have those shovels, and we're going to see where we're going to place these beautiful pond apple trees inside of this pond, so let's get going. It is time to put these waders on. Ready? One, two, and three. Let's get inside this pond, you guys, and start digging some holes for these pond apple trees. Let's do it. God damn, I'm up to my knees in mud, bro. I'm up to my knees in mud. Yeah, it's real deep in mud. All right, but I'm coming right behind you. You want to shovel? Yeah. All right, so what you could do right now, what we can do is these two right here are going to go over there, and one of the other two are staying right here. So you can grab one, I can grab one, and we can do it right now, okay? Okay. All right, so where are you going to put that one? Right here. Perfect. So I like your seat. You can start digging that one out over there, and I'm going to dig a hole. Right over there. Oh, that was a rock. That's a rock. Ow, that's my dirt. <laughs> over here, I'm digging another hole right here. He's Dylan's digging a hole right there. I'm digging a hole here. So it's going to be a tree, tree, tree. And then two trees over there. So then there'll be trees all around here and it'll be able to hold up the walls up. So when it floods up, the mud doesn't all fall inside of this pond and then we have a nice pond. I'd have planted it! Take the damn thing out. The, it, the, I, bucket. Like the, the bucket thing? Yep. Okay. But how do I put the plant in it? If the bucket doesn't go in it. Squeeze it, hug it, give it a big hug. Big hug. Oh yeah. There now what go. happened? Now try to pull it out. There you go. It ain't coming out. <laughs> All right, give it another hug. Come go, oh, pull it. All right, come. Oh! Water's cold. turtles in here right now but the water is very very cold so they're gonna stay on the bottom and just chill there so that sun comes back out
Oh yeah, these plants are gonna do great here at the water level. They'll do amazing. I need your help taking this one out too. Oh, there's another one right there. That's the thing. All right, get it go over there. Yeah, you ready? Good. Got it. No, it's a hat. Put on your head. No, 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 no. It's a hat. Your head. This is that is perfect right there. There we go. There we go. There you go. Perfect. Look at that. Nice planted right there. When the water level rises a little bit more, it's going to be a perfect water side. Perfect. So we're gonna grow this way over the pond to look beautiful. We got one there, one there, one here. We're gonna add two more over here. Heck yeah, let's do the other two real quick. Wait, what kind of turtle is this one? That's a hill or eye side neck turtle. Okay, hill or eye side neck turtle. Why do they call it side neck turtle? Everything on this section is from Brazil. Well, South America, my bad. Why is this one neck way longer than this one? A side neck turtle, and that's a wood turtle. Pretty cool. Why do they call them side neck turtles? Because they're neck moving sideways? I think all turtles that are close to the equator or something like that, their necks go to the side. So I'm not, I don't think me too. Why, right, Nick? Keep putting me on the spot. From so slow retro, okay. let's hear it. Because on the equator, the current in the water is really quick, so the neck's always being pushed to the side. And you don't even have a sore neck in the morning when you wake up and sleep like that. <laughs> <laughs> they always got a sore neck. <laughs> Boy, you sound dumb as good, good explanation. I like that opinion. <laughs> what? What hat's on my head? Like black one? I'm digging another hole right here, you guys, for this one that has four fingers. It's going to sit right here. It's going to look perfect when it grows up nice and high right here. I'm going to do that right now. And we might add one more down over there. Well, the whole section over there, there, we had a bunch of plants and it pulled in very well. Where the heck did Dylan go, you guys? Where the heck did he go? Yeah! <laughs> I got some! <laughs> there he is! We found him! You found a turtle too? I got two of them! Heck yeah! <laughs> That's the real turtle man right there! Yeah, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> you alright? I'm good. Alright, cool. I landed on a turtle. No, you didn't. Nah, I'm good. Yeah, all right. They move fast. They move real fast. <laughs> they saw they saw your ass coming. They ran. <laughs> alright, so Dylan's gonna start digging right over there. And I'm gonna take this plant till him so he's ready to put that plant in there. Yeah, dig right there, straight down. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, I'm coming over there now with the plant. Well, Ah, oh, there we go. How's it look? It's rocky. All right, don't go too far in. Dig um, down right there a little bit and you're good. But you know, if I dig down, this will fall. So. All right, 
Ready, Dylan? Yeah, I need that All right, plant. You got the plant? Yeah. Put it in just like this, how it is. Just like that. Uh! One. There you go. Turn it a little bit that way. A little more. That way. No, no, not that far. No, like straight that way. Like that one? Yeah, like facing that Like way. that point facing that tree. A little bit that way, yeah. Okay. Oh, Perfect. Uh, there we go. That's what I like to see. <laughs> Teamwork, bro. Beautiful. Perfect. Teamwork makes the dream work. Yes, sir. Yeah, just throw it on the top and the back. Oh, yeah. Heck, yeah. What I like to see. Putting his hands deep in that mud, doing real good. Ah, <laughs> uh, she's in. Cool. I get out now? You're good. Okay. Your job is done. Good job. Thank you. So you guys, we have five apple trees here inside of this beautiful, massive new turtle pond that we have here on the ranch. As you guys can see, it looks great, it looks awesome. We had the help of Dylan. Make sure you follow him on Instagram. And as well, make sure you follow me, Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch, on Instagram as well. Because we do live streams all the time here on the ranch and you guys have the opportunity to get exclusive content on Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch on Instagram. So do that as well. A lot of things are still have to come here. We still have to add more bushes. So many different things are always adding here on the ranch all the time. Put those post notifications on you guys. Subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys on the upcoming adventure here at Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch. Peace out everybody.